Guess who is on call with me? The former director of Infosys and the current chairman of the Manipal Global Education, a Padma Shri Awardi, a Bangalorean, Mr. Mohan Das Pai. Yeah, Disha, tell me. Mr. Pai, um, you were one of the early names to tweet about uh, the film Kashmir Files being made tax-free in Karnataka and the next day it was announced that in Karnataka it's tax-free. How happy are you about that? No, I'm very happy because it is a truly extraordinary film. It uh, shows the reality of something that happened many years ago in Kashmir and how a large part of the population were affected. This has been hidden from us for a long period of time. It is time that all of us know the truth so that such things can never happen again in this country. So I'm very happy that the government has given them a tax break. Mr. Pai, if I can ask you, you have been very active in public life and you're a very well-read, well-aware, well-traveled man. Taking you back to 1990, where were you back in the 90s, early 90s? Well, in the early 90s, I was in Bangalore and, uh, you know, we are clustered here in Bangalore from events that happened in the north. Information flows are not there. We read in the newspapers what happened to the Pandits and the exodus of the Pandit, but we didn't know much of the gory details. And I think it was hidden from us. Uh, so it was painful. But I guess a lot of things are happening at that uh, point of time and everybody glossed it over. And these people were left to fend for themselves. What we need to understand is that all of us are citizens of this great country. All of us have equal rights. And all of us require the protection of the state. And the state has failed. You know, we were there, but I don't think we understood the gravity and the impact of what happened. Because, you know, right. it's very difficult to understand that such barbarity and such cruelty can actually happen. Mr. Pai, before I let you go, people who are listening, the ones who are still on the fence about, you know, whether or not we should go watch the movie, what would you like to tell them? Well, I would urge all Indians and Indian citizens to go watch the film, to know how the state and the Republic of India failed all of us as citizens so that we understand the gravity of the situation, how one section of society has been brutalized, killed and driven out of the homeland, so that never again, never again in the future in India, such a thing can happen to any community. It is not about one single community, it is about any community. It should not happen again. So we should all go there, see it with our own eyes and feel the emotion of being brutalized, of being of a community being murdered in cold blood, driven out. And the state, uh, the great Republic of India, uh, which promises to look after everybody and to protect its citizens, uh, not, uh, you know, demonstrating his, uh, his purpose. So I think we should go for that purpose alone and resolve internally. Mr. Pai, thank you so much for your time. As articulate as ever, it's a pleasure speaking with you, sir. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you, you, Mr. Thank Pai. You. Thank you. For best entertainment, subscribe to Red FM Bengaluru page. For more updates, press the bell icon.